Welcome Aries to Petrella's Intuitive Insights. This is a brief overview of May 15th to the 31st of 2020. As I was getting into the energy of the Aries, the overwhelming sense of signs, S-I-G-N-S, -S, signs. I feel that you've seen signs, whether it's through dreaming, fleeting dreamings that you just remember, uh, you, you physically, you'll be thinking about a person, listening to a song, and it makes you think about another person. And next thing you know, you hear about that person, hear news about that person. And that news is gonna pertain greatly to projects that you're working on. And I feel that it's gonna take a great deal of courage for the Aries to step out into, uh, I, and I heard relationships, boundaries, Barriers, and I feel that maybe there were boundaries and barriers between um, you and another person. And this is where it's going to take great courage. And I heard that many of the uh, Aries saying, maybe not so much, I'm sorry, but in a good way. Again, sending signs, sending flowers, sending thank you. This is going to take a great deal of courage. For some of you, you're going to be getting out of a relationship or stepping a little bit further away than you really anticipated because you know that this isn't what you want. You've learned from your past mistakes. Yeah, time, time, I feel that time, time, time. So for some of you young Aries, I feel that you're thinking, I don't wanna waste a lot of time. And for some of you older Aries, you're thinking, I've already wasted too much time. And I feel that this is pertaining to a friend. This is about love. This is about relationships. And I do feel that it is pertaining to money, this relationship. It may be pertaining to money, karmically linked somehow to finance, finance for the Aries. Um, there is going to be a new beginning, but I do feel that uh, for some of you Aries, this is karmic, these relationships. And you need to, especially with this ring, this ring, this ring, this ring. And, and I feel that there's a sense of obligation uh, karmic obligation, yet if you could, you would just pull up anchor and set sail. I don't feel that this is really what the Aries is looking for. Now, I do feel that whether this is the Aries or who the Aries is associating with, but I do feel that the Aries is struggling with some sort of non-chemical addiction, a non-chemical addiction which would ultimately, if you're getting uh, a rush, it's gonna produce hormones. But um, I do feel that for some of you, this could be uh, when you get into the exercising, overworking, uh, a sex addiction, a food addiction. Um, there's uh, several other addictions that does not necessarily mean some hardcore drug. And I feel that you need to set this in, in line because it's affected you financially. It's affected your career and finance, this addiction, Aries. Aries. So what do the Aries need to know that would be watching this video pertaining to love and romance and relationships? May 15th to the 30th. See, some heavy-duty thinking going on really heavy duty thinking about some friends, a particular friend. Yeah, it's, it's, there's gonna be healing taking place because it's gonna shift the foundation of where you're living, who you're living with, your home life. Uh, things are totally gonna be shifting and then healing needs to start. Um, and this is going to where this courage could possibly take place here, Aries. Let's look at these again. They fell out of the deck. The tower card is crumbling. So your home life is shifting. It's changing. It's no longer what it was. It is pertaining to friends. This is a dear friend. And here's the masculine energy. And here's the healing. So um, I do feel that for this Aries, whether you're the masculine energy or the other side is the masculine energy. And look, at the bottom of the deck is absolutely the money tree because all of this has affected the career and finance. And I feel that you've tied it up in such a way that now you're seeing clear signs, clear signs from the divine, and now you're recognizing them this time. Aries, 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 it's matters of the heart. 
What do the Aries need to know that will be watching this video pertaining to love, romance, and relationship May 15th to the 31st of 2020? Aries. Nothing's flying out, so let's just, this is what got, this is what came out. The tower card, friend card, masculine energy, really doing some heavy soul searching. And the healing card, ultimately, love, romance, and relationships. Career finance, Aries, what do the Aries need to know that will be watching this video pertaining to <clears throat> career and finance? <clears throat> Again, signs. Oh, karmic. Karmic, karma, karma, karma. Karma's coming back to you. <laughs> Aries, for some of you, you're going to realize it's a kick in the pants. But for others of you, it's going to be a mixed bag. And you're going to say, yeah, karma's coming back. I did this guy a favor. Now here comes the favor back at me. So Aries, this when karma comes back, it could be a really good thing. And for you Aries, it does seem to be more of a mixed bag. The mystery is going to be revealed when it comes to this. Because I feel when it comes to career finance, um, you've had some questions lingering. And now you're going to get the answers to them. You're getting the answers. And they may be pertaining to people and relationships. Yes. You're, yes, absolutely. You're getting your answers now, Aries. Mm-hmm. And it's going to, oh, it's a lot of heavy feminine energy here. And it is going to bring about a brand new beginning. A brand new beginning is, is on the horizon for the Aries. So Aries, if this resonated with you, please click like, share, and subscribe. And if you would like a private reading, PetrellasIntuitiveInsights.com. The information is listed in the link below. Thank you very much, and God bless you.